Uh oh, it's nighttime, which only means one thing. Sandra couldn't vlog today. But it's because I was on set. And this means this is my stunt bag. That's that's my stunt bag. It has my pads in there that I had to use today. Because I had to, what did I do today? I just fell on the ground and then I got kicked backwards onto my butt. That was about it. It was a good day. It was a good day. I wanted to tell you a story this morning and I totally forgot it. Oh yeah, okay. Do you have work dreams sometimes? Like where you, you dream of when you're, <laughs> I didn't want to talk. I can't form words right now because I'm really excited that I actually get to talk to you guys now because I've been wanting to tell you the story. Okay, what's the story? Okay, um, do you ever have work dreams and they're kind of like night terrors where you wake up, oh, I'm talking to a camera. <laughs> anyway, uh, <laughs> it's not weird. Oh no, sorry, I didn't mean to, I didn't mean to. Um, Okay, this is my train. I'll tell you guys in a minute or two. Okay, let me calm down so I can actually form thoughts. Um, what I was trying to say was have you ever had those dreams where you dream about work and you start waking up in the middle of the night because it's kind of like a night terror in a way, like you forget everything possible that you could have brought to work and you've ruined everyone's work day and it's all on you because of it and then you just keep waking up and waking up and you're like, then you get scared because you're like, did I forget something? That happened to me last night. I don't understand why, but I was just like, I'm gonna forget all of my things that I need to bring. I'm gonna forget stunt pads. I'm gonna forget what I have to wear. So I'm just gonna show up naked. It was just the worst thing. Ah, it's a raccoon and it's looking right at me. Ah. I forgot that I had makeup still on from the shoot and it looks like I've been crying. People have probably been like, what is that girl's problem? Why is she crying in public? Gosh, I wasn't crying. Okay, I'm like super bored and I was watching some fairy tale. That's an anime for those that don't know. And I'm dressing up as one of the characters when I go to an anime convention this summer. And I was trying to figure out how I was gonna do my makeup because uh, it just doesn't look good with the wig that I have. But then I was like, what if I cover up my eyebrows and draw eyebrows on? Draw. Why don't you just not talk properly? I feel like sometimes I should have an accent or maybe I should just not speak at all. Anyway, um, so I'm like, I want to try erasing my eyebrows from my face. Now I'm going to use my really expensive makeup to do this. No, I'll use my crappy makeup instead. That's a better idea. Um, but the girl who's doing my makeup for the actual thing will probably have makeup that will actually cover up my eyebrows. But I'm interested. I want to draw eyebrows on. I've never done that before. And this isn't me being girly. It's me doing an experiment. I'm a scientist, okay? Not being girly. Well, my eyebrows are still there. <laughs> they just look like they have white flecks of makeup in it. Jesse, it didn't work. I still have eyebrows. I'm well, no, you're not. You have you have pants on. You actually scared me for a second. I was like, what do I do? Where do I go? The sh Jeez. Um, he just, just you can get like thick, like like skin colored paint, can't you? Like stuff is made to cover up eyebrows. I think there's like prosthetics or something. Prosthetics, or like an arm. I mean, I mean, okay. I mean, like the the stuff that people do prosthetics with, isn't it like you build up certain stuff? Like you, can, yeah, there's stuff you can put over your eyebrows. Yeah, maybe I'll do. Maybe I'll have to do that. I don't know. I st I want it to look good. I want to look like Arizona the Scarlet. Jeez, is it that hard? Yeah, probably. This is what happens when I get bored. Uh, so much makeup on my face. And I have black eyebrows, that's a first. And I can move them. I am not Cassandra. I am not Cassandra. I am a human being. Although I do enjoy putting makeup on for the fun of it sometimes, I have to admit that nothing feels better when you are confident with your face and you don't feel like you have to hide anything. And I know I put cover up on to hide blemishes and pimples that I have but over the years I have gotten more confident in myself and in my skin and my appearance and it feels so much better when I know I can go around without makeup on and I don't even care but also I go out in baggy shirts and baggy pants 
So maybe I just don't care about my appearance at all. <laughs> I do care about my appearance, but I also know that I don't have to make myself all dolled up to feel good about myself. And that's not a bad thing if you do, because I've gone through that. Guys go through that, people go through that all the time, and people do that, but I am happy with myself in the way that I feel confident about how I look, and I don't need makeup to do that for me. And although people don't think they look nice without things to accessorize their looks, believe it or not, sometimes I don't even notice those things. And when you take them off, I don't even notice they're gone. So, I mean, like, eyeliner. I'm not talking about clothes, guys. Whoa. Whoa. Anyway, I have to leave you with a rant before I go to bed, and that was my rant tonight. Awesome thing of the day. Um... Not putting other people in a tired mood. I was really tired today, and I was like, I'm just gonna stay away from people so that they <laughs> don't catch on with my tiredness, so that's why I've kind of been like, bleh, hyper, but bleh. I don't know. Anyway, good night. Also, this is Dead Morning Editing Cassandra telling you to go check out my Tumblr because I took some pictures in the wig and you might like it. Tumblr's in the down bar. Also, I made a attempt at a stunt reel. So go check that out too. The link will be in the, the that thing. <laughs> so right there. <laughs>